All oh, right, we're back. So we have these mysterious, slimy, slithering trails that have gone somewhere. Okay, let's search these stones. Okay, searching these stones reveals nothing of interest. And you know what? Just for the heck of it, since I'm talking to someone who, since XL currently is XL's king, doesn't have much that he can think to do right now, how about I'm just gonna randomly ask for, and during this video's comments, how about? Um, if you want to, feel free to post what your favorite in-game activity is. Just, well, in-game, like, thing to do. Not mini-game activity, just anything that you like to do in-game that, like, really keeps you going for the game. Bizarre tracks leading away from the soul bush in the direction of the Rusty Anchor Pub. Ooh, a mound. Let's check this mound. Sure enough, it seems the pest has gone underground here. Karasu will want to know about this. Okay, so, yeah, be careful there, Spine. Don't want to go talking about any problem with... Oh, Clue. He, I didn't see it with Clue. Alright, anyway, we're talking. We're gonna go talk to Karasi. Why don't they follow me around or something? Right now, they're not doing much of anything. And um, they appeared right into the land of the and told the palace of Voinet all the world near the money they informed for had come. Am um, I interrupting something? Jessica asked me to tell them about the Void Knight's beliefs. I have agreed as maybe her actions earlier with result of ignorance rather than malice. I admit I have knew why Void Knights have such hatred for the pests. Fighting them is one thing since they're invaders, but I'm only now beginning to understand how far it goes. Hmm. If you can grasp their presence is an imbalance and a blasphemy against Guthix, that may be help for you yet. Now then, Guthix, I take it you have news. I've tracked the pest out of their entrance, and I believe you can gain access to it from the cellar of the Rusty Anchor Pub. Good work. Head over with the pub and we'll meet you there once you've gained access. I'll ask about this. What was that our I believe? Are you interested in learning more? Actually, yeah, personally, personally I am, so you're gonna get to read through this. Yes, I am. Here's a bit copy of the book of the Jessica found. Perhaps you'll find it useful too. Okay, so. <laughs> Looks like Spine's not having some good stuff with puzzles. And by the way, I'll tell you right now, I cannot wait to do Elite Clues oh, in Elite Clues Scroll, even though I'm not one for boss fighting. I really want to do that Celtic Knot puzzle. Anyway, and actually, I'll have just a completely extra episode with just me reading the Void Net book, even though it probably isn't. Actually, I'll just quickly open it up right now. I'm, well, I was gonna, I'm just gonna go through all this as much as I can. And see how much I, how many pages there are to see if I can just read the whole thing as one of my. Okay, so I have 14 total pages that I have to read through. Let's talk to the bartender. Damn it, the delivery dwarf's in the way. Okay, so. Good day to you. Ugh, this girl's sick or got sick just recently. Too tired to have a good day. Hmm. That's the same kind of sickness that that guy on the boat had. Maybe the pest is causing it. I have used to believe that there's a dangerous animal bird on your pub. May I investigate for you? Okay. Um, you're right. Dangerous animal on the <laughs> Possible otherworldly terror in your, in your basement. Yeah, there's one if you want. I don't want the clue to sell it somewhere around here. I'll just get right on that. Don't strain anything. Okay, so let's just search junk. Use, search junk. Damn it. That damn dwarf is in the way. Let's search junk. Draws. Use. More junk. Fuck. On the pile of stuff, you find a large crude key. Okay, so let's head back. Let's head into this uh, cellar. If I can. Ah, great. Have I lost my connection somehow or something? Oh, okay. Huh. What do you know? It's fine. So basically, I just gotta find my way into a cellar. The trap door's over here, so we will now head into the trap door. Okay, we enter the trap door. What do we find? Here comes Karasi with her awesome sword and Jessica. Good, good. Now then, you, you two, please see what you can find. Roger that, roger that, sir. What? 
so you just have a little aura of command thing going on. When I have had the full void and officer training, perhaps it has some effect. <laughs> it's like a suspicious looking wall. This wall looks dodgy, like something has to sew the ground behind it. Perhaps if I knock a hole in it, I'll find the bone. This thing they go requires a suitable tool. Let's see if Jessica has any tools for me. What's up, Jessica? You said I'm missing a bit of bone in here. Pet? Pest. Have a look around and see if you can find anything out of the ordinary. Okay, Jessica's definitely has gone one up in my suspiciousness level now with that pet. One thing is that I need probably a hammer. A suitable tool of probably a hammer. Perhaps I can go with Karasu, or I'll watch the through mech thing. Hello, Karasu. Yeah, I can figure anything. The sort of investigation more Jessica's field than mine, I think. Yep, I'll have to get my own tools. Damn. So, we will now have to run straight back. And, like, I mean, like, most of the recent Jagex quests have more th seemed to add in the idea of just getting tools right where you need them. So, I'm glad, I'm actually, even though it's a little annoying to run back, I like how you have, um, how I have to run back to my bank to get the tools that I need. So, I'll get a pickaxe, a hammer, and I'll probably want to get a few other things just in case I might need some. Summoning level is probably needed to talk to it. Go to our map. Let's head to pick. Uh, hammer. A spade's always nice. Never know anyone with a chisel. Barb to hug underneath that. Eh, hatchet. You never know why I might have to chop through some vines. And rope the in reality, one of the most useful things in the world. In RuneScape, not so much. Okay, so let's now run back with a few extra tools. I'll probably be missing something and I'll have to run back again. But hey, that's what this is all about, anyway. Alright, so we are now continuing to run. Now, and actually, I don't know why, as I'm running back, um, my answer for what my favorite thing to do is I love the minigames. I love the minigame stealing creation. I like dungeoneering. Well, sometimes. But usually I just do whatever the hell I feel like, and that's kind of base, is based on your own instinct. Okay, so let's head down to the trapdoor again. Climb, 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 and cross it. Just go in here. Am I gonna have to go through this little thing again? Damn it. And usual dialogue. Okay, so let's see if I can inspect this wall. I will use a pickaxe. Your pickaxe smashes a very large wall on the wall, and a thick goo starts to flow out. What's that mean to give? Is that stuff? Can you get the other way, please? What's up, Jessica? That's very curious stuff. You should take a sample of it. Why would you want goo? Because it's something I've not seen before, and it may give us clues on or insights about each more pest. I need to get a, get a container of some sort. It's just enough, before it's all wasted. You know, a bucket or something will do. But by the looks of that flow of material, I need an empty barrel or something. Maybe there's one in the storage room next door. Oh, wait, so we have to just run back and get this goo? Okay, full barrel? Oh, I have to enter the store again. So. Whoa. This place is, a me is in a mess, Karasi. See if you can find this empty bear, please, come for them through. I've given you a void now, whistle in case you get into difficulties. I'm sure people will come and help me move the barrel back a step. A long blast will give you a hand so you can move back to how it was. Okay, this full barrel. Kick. Okay. So, I've got to get to that. Where's the empty barrel? So I've got a. Hmm. Oh great! So I've got to kick it back too. Damn. But I think I know what I can do here. So let's first kick that barrel. Then I'll kick this barrel. Kick. And then we will kick this barrel. Now I probably just want to. Kick this into a corner. So now I can get to the empty barrel, but I need to get it through that doorway. The only thing is that. Okay, if I kick this out of the way. Oh okay, great, I'm gonna need to do a, a bit of a walk around in order to. Because these two barrels are in the way here. So, but actually, you know what? 
I'm gonna wait until my next video before I finish this. So that way you have time to watch me kick around barrels. Alright, so I'll see you in my next video, and remember to post about what your favorite thing to do in your escape is.